Yes, family, here we are, Stadium View Estate and our good brother Craig Norman development uh, that we have seen over the years. So the entrance and the beginning portion has been completed. And now we're gonna take a walk to the back area and then we're just gonna come around since the gate is closed. But this is actually the main entrance that he has where, you know, where a car can drive in and out. And so this uh, entire area is just the, basically what you call it is the real estate office. Hey love, hold on for us. Hold on, hold on, tell the hold. All right, and unfortunately our brother is in the middle of making a move back to the state. So we're gonna uh, view the property and you already seen the number at the beginning if you ever wanna reach out and connect to Craig Norman. And this is uh, where we uh, started the last time. And this is the main building on the project. And then these are, you know, the, big, the first set of lots that are available. But last time we came to uh, this door, or I should say this uh, gate, and this is that view. He has the pillars up, and then he also has, and last time what we did was uh, we went up here and went on the actual roof. So we was able to see a roof access view of uh, the area, so that was uh, perfect. Yes, yeah, so um, Pius, the stadium must be closed then. Or I think maybe he is building it for the future stadium. Something like that, because Grand Grand Stadium is far. Wow. I'm, I'm gonna say don't depend on the GPS. So family, be mindful of the GPS that you're using when you're outside the city in uh, Ghana. Because uh, once we got out here, the GPS has been throwing us off. So. Sometimes you just gotta know where you're going. And so this is the entrance uh, security uh, guard area. And then once you come on in. The, oh no, we're gonna go down to that house and that's it. I just, I just, wanna, I just wanna show everybody that house and that's it. But uh, when I first came here, it was nothing here. So it's all of us are doing the same thing. He's actually, we probably have more buildings on our property, but he has more infrastructure. And that's what I like about him, he's a straight infrastructure guy. And you know, which we all should be. That's one of the first homes that he mentioned. He told me that the, the first home is finished. You remember when he came here, like none of this existed? Well, a few years ago. So family, come on with us and uh, come on, let's, uh, let's take a walk and check out at least the building. We can, can we go in there? Yeah, so that's what we're going to be doing. We're going to be just viewing the, viewing the finished building. So security man. Yes, yes. Do you know some of the prices for some of the lots? I know they've gone up over a period of time. What did, what did about 15000 now? It was a 12500 one time. Around that time. So family, at the beginning, you see we got the uh, phone number and we got the details. So we just want you to reach out and you can also you know, connect with myself. Uh, you know, we was here, so might as well come on through and check it out. And I just remember being here the last time. And so that is our goal right here. The view this, to view this beautiful home. Is there, is there any furniture in it? Is it it's completely completed? Oh, this is the model. It's complete. It's a complete model. Yeah. Is it a model of somebody moving in? No, not yet. So it's just a model. So somebody bought and paid for the house somebody and got it ready. Did? They yes, bought yes, and paid yes, for it. Yes, yes. Oh, so it's somebody property then. 
All right, let me just uh, wait for our wonderful people. So that's it, family. That's what we're going to go check out. All right, those houses are on a different property, right? Yes, that is different property. On the other side, yes. all right? So, family, these are some pillars and walls coming up. Yeah. So, when you're thinking about community development, this is from the ground up. And uh, does he have the drainage running underground? Yeah. All right, so, so the drainage is digged all the way down. Yes. So, that's it, family, right there. So the property is not going to flood. That, and that's the purpose, family, of putting in proper drainage. So, so family, welcome to Stadium View Estate. So Jeff Ace, uh, this is it right here. This is the, the fresh drainage that they're built in. So that's it, Mohammed. So that's what you and I gotta do in our community. We gotta build nice, clean drainage and, and run it down and bury it. So what you're seeing, family, is in this uh, you know, foundation stage. And so all of these are all lots and most of these lots have been sold. So you may just have a few available. And as I mentioned to you, the price started at one point at 12500 per lot. And now it's a little higher, but you can always reach out and get updates and get updated details. And it's always incredible when you have, uh, when you always have the first uh, two finished house. Like right now in our community, we have about, uh, we have about four finished homes. There you go. <laughs> so he has a few finish. Uh, so little by little, we all getting there. Now we're still ahead of everybody else with a few finish, few finished homes. But uh, I like the fact that the land is not overgrown. Uh, so so, actually, so this place is, is, is not overgrown. It doesn't grow fast. It doesn't grow fast. I wish I could inherit that blessing because, man, yeah, the amount of money we have to spend on chopping and cutting yeah, and maintaining yeah, yeah, is yeah, unbelievable. <laughs> And when it's uh, sun, uh, sun, sun, um, uh, summertime, you know, all the grass get, you know, dry. Yeah. And you see the floor, you see the ground the way they <laughs> Yeah, because this, yeah. this is good. Um, this is good. But so, yes, my brother, you going to let us in? They've closed it. Yeah, they have closed it. They have closed it? All right, since they have closed it, we're just going to walk around. There you go. Right. All right. All of this new little. So the house is still being touched up, and this is one plot of land. And look at uh, look at this you know, nice little backyard space. So this is um. I would say some of our lots are a little bit bigger. We have 80 by 100. This should be um 70 by 100, right? 70 by 100. So that's the difference. Uh, they're lot 70 by 100. Ours is 100 by 80. Yeah. And so nice little backyard, balcony. This is nice, nice. So just, just got to do a little maintenance. And so now what is this right over here? Is that going to be the water system? Oh, 
All right, so what you've seen is development from the ground up. And it's um, a lot of times in America, all we see is finished homes. But we're showing you the art of the foundation, raw land, to developing it and showing you every single aspect of the development from clearing it, building a foundation, walls up, roof up, you know, all those good things. You know, we have, so now we're trying to see more finished homes, and I get you, family. That is our goal, to show more finished homes. So when you get to our uh, Black South Pan-African community, you're going to see at least three to four finished homes. Okay, absolutely, brother. Let's, uh, let's see about that. Yes, sir. Uh, yes, it definitely ends before all those additional buildings in the back. It's uh, it's basically a good uh, 10 acres. Okay. Uh, yes, yeah, so these are the last set of plots back here. Okay. And uh, on that side, those homes are for, on another community. Okay. So this, uh, you know, this even gives more people a chance to see you know, unfinished products. Yes, sir. That is a great question as far as the price. Probably about over a hundred thousand. To build this, right? Yeah. Um, I, I would say this. I would say about closer to a hundred thousand. Probably nine to Joanne, how much would you pay for this? Yeah. So, about how much would you pay for this? About one hundred twenty thousand. Uh, that's what I'm hearing. I think you said it was 145,000. Okay, so you want to keep it affordable for Dinosaurus. Thank God. So, good side of the room. We went in one before it got built. You know, it was like, right, I remember. Oh, yeah, I came out here. So, five bedrooms. Five bedrooms, y'all. When we saw it was four bedrooms. And he said that two bedrooms. Right, beautiful, beautiful. We are in Prom Prom, a stadium view estate, and excellent job, excellent work. This is incredibly beautiful. The utility room right there. This is nice. So that's it. So, can we go upstairs? No. All right, we're going upstairs. Hundred and twenty five to hundred fifty thousand. And you know that's more or less based on what you put in it. it the, the, we're gonna see the big back balcony. There we go. And this this way we were well, it's five bedroom, like a three bathroom. Yes, and we got another top view. There you go, family. Look at the beauty of 
this community. And that's where we were early at the beginning. So I want to say family, last time we were here was our May 2022. Basically a little over two years ago. And so that's how you deal with development family. Just work on it little by little. I know you're talking, but if we oh, get a chance, just go ahead. explain something. Oh, no, answer, ask any questions. I'm just talking and recording. Oh, okay, now, I think as I understand it, uh, many of these, uh, I see lots of buildings under construction, various stages. Okay. So people are just kind of paying out of their pockets. They pay as much as they can, get done, and then get so more you, money, and then pay. Is that how? You, you, you pay as you go along. So you, you'll pay for the land, then you pay for your foundation, you pay for walls up, roof, okay. then you start working interior. So a lot of these development to make it affordable for all of us are uh, we can take up to two years to build okay. and then within that two years you're financing it little by little I see. Uh, versus taking out a full 30-year mortgage okay so in two years you're paid in full Gotcha. And it's the same concept we have in our community. So, so, so is there an issue of availability of product and, and, and that kind of thing? If somebody have a full right 200,000, you, you're good. But sometimes, you know, you yeah, may I have understand. to do 50, 50, 50, 50. Gotcha. Yeah. <laughs> I got you trying to check it out. Oh, so Sandra's getting happy. <laughs> yeah, Sandra's getting happy. I can call the banker and have $130,000 yeah, so, um... Okay, y'all stay with y'all. We are playing that. All right. All right. Big family house. And this is the... And then One of the supreme restrooms. So, uh, this is another bedroom. Yeah. And a spacious bedroom. Yeah. 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 Yes, sir. Let me get on down. Yes, sir. I hope y'all love it. Love it. Love it. Love it. Love it. Yes, yes sir. No, these are all homes that for other people. You know, this so is not uh, his home? No, I mean everybody no, every, all the lots have been paid for and then some people are starting to build. Okay, so these are all sold out. Ah uh, yes, it, it, it's, it's maybe only a few lots that he has left. Because okay. everybody's working on a phase to build now. Uh, especially after the COVID of uh, this like the COVID uh, era is kinda like closed out. Uh, I didn't know. I didn't know this. Um, I didn't know this one down here. All I saw was just a living area, living room, dining room, family room, utility closet. So next time we come, we'll see the complete finished product, you know, walls set on in and house ready to move in. And so family, we're going to be heading out and that is our direction we're going to be driving down. And this is the main road in the Stadium View community. All right, so family, the journey continues. And if you have an interest in this uh, product, uh, you can reach out to us and we'll get you connected to our good brother, Craig Norman. Uh, so you can get a good feel of uh, this project and get full clarity. So right now, family, we are in Prom Prom. So this location is Prom Prom in the heart of Prom Prom. And it's a great place to live. So we look forward to uh, giving you another update when we come back here next year. 
and just um, look forward to keep on working and connecting with our good brothers that are developing towns and communities for us to repatriate, live, do business, and just enjoy the beauty of Africa.